Summertime Ken with STK's Adventure Channel and wanted to show you guys this is uh, the Toro 22 inch low wheel recycle recycler mower picked up from my Home Depot um, just under 300 bucks for it but uh, it's springtime grass is starting to grow so we are going to unbox this put it together um, but again, Toro, probably the, uh, the best name in lawn mowers. This is a, again, 22 inch uh, low wheel. I didn't get the high wheel in the back. It's about another, oh, 30, 40 bucks for the high wheel for better maneuverability. Um, didn't think that I necessarily needed that. Um, varying uh, speed, self-propelled mower. Um, it's got easy change from bagging to mulching. Uh, one key thing about this, um, that I noticed and that we will definitely test out is no oil change required. Um, so the gentleman at Home Depot is telling me that uh, you basically just add oil when it needs oil, uh, but no need to actually change the oil. So we're gonna go ahead and get into this. So we've taken the uh, mower and all parts outside of the box. Um, Toro has a really good um, instruction manual here, just with pictures showing you. It's very uh, simple put together. Um, looks like it's just attaching the handle to the mower. And so we are gonna go ahead and get started on that. So we have removed, the bag is just uh, in the box, it's just sitting on top of the mower, so you can remove the bag compartment. Um, and then in assembling the handle here, just make sure, it's got two notches or holes here. The bottom one is gonna fit into these slots like that. Make sure that they are in all the way and you can see flush there and then you will see in the box um, two of these here so one thing you're going to want to do is um, if you can see right here this bolt has a little square um, piece right up next to the head and what that's going to do is actually fit into a square piece of the actual bracket it's going to go into and you're going to want to fit that in first before you start screwing in um, the knob here. I'll show you what I'm talking about. And just make sure that's flush against it right there. Screw that knob all the way in so that it's tight, and we'll do the same thing on the other side. Alright, so the handlebars are uh, securely in place. Make sure obviously we remove all the plastic. One thing you'll notice too, um, obviously there's a bag component if you want the bag of grass to put on the back. Um, and then also in the box is 
your oil, and the side sheet here. Um, if you wanted to mulch and uh, shoot the grass off to the side, it goes on the side over there. And then this is your oil again. Obviously, it doesn't come with oil in it, but it does come with um, the SAE 30 Toro lawnmower oil. Um, and again, just important, um, you know, one of the key features, and obviously you add your oil in over here, um, but one of the key features is you never have to uh, actually change and drain the oil. Um, you just uh, check it, and if it's uh, it's not full, you just top it off. So, uh, neat feature there on the new Toros, but hope this video has been helpful. Pretty easy uh, assembling of the handlebar here. And uh, you know, have a good day. Let's start mowing.